What's up YouTube, Jeff back again. And today I'm very excited because it's not very often that Samsung releases a brand new app. And that's exactly what's happened today. Samsung has launched a new app and this app is pretty much magic to be honest with you. It is a new photo enhancing app called Galaxy Enhance X. It's an AI photo upscaler and magic editing app from Samsung. You see made from Samsung, Samsung Electronics Company. Um, this was actually released a little while ago, but it's just now widely available and rolling out via the Galaxy Store. So I figured now is the perfect time to take a look at it. You guys can see here some of the features. Uh, you can enhance your photos with a one tap and then kind of get that going super quickly. And uh, that's something that I am really excited about. We're going to take a look at some features today. Before I get into that, I do want to mention an awesome product that my friends over at Ugreen sent out to me. This is their 7-in-1 USB-C multifunction adapter, and this thing has some really nice features. You can get 4K 60Hz HDMI output with this. You also get uh, an Ethernet port with 1000 megs per second, USB-C charging port with 100 watt power delivery pass-through. Here's the actual adapter. Now, the cool thing about this is you might think, why is this a good accessory to use with the S22 Ultra? There you can see the different ports. You got USB ports, place for an SD reader. On the back, you've got your pass-through for charging and HDMI and the ethernet. This reason this is a great uh, adapter for your Galaxy devices is because you can use this with Samsung DeX to expand your desktop setup. So if you wanna use your Galaxy S22 Ultra as your main on-the-go computing solution, you can go ahead and plug this adapter right into the Galaxy S22 Ultra, add on your SD card, you can add on all of your other things that you need like peripherals, a mouse, you can set up a monitor with a charging solution and use this as your main setup for DeX. Um, that's the main reason that I would say that this is a great setup because it does work with your Galaxy devices and DeX. I've been using this with my Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra, which is my main DeX device, and it works fantastic. I can plug in my SD card, I can connect a mouse, I can even connect an external keyboard if I don't wanna use my keyboard case. Just a fantastic solution for using this as a docked Samsung DeX setup. So really, really nice stock from my friends over at Ugreen. We are going to have a link in the description as well as the pinned comment if you guys want to check out the Ugreen 7-in-1 USB-C multifunction adapter. I would encourage you if you use Samsung DeX a lot to check this out and give it a go. As well as any coupon codes, the link will be in the description for you guys. Okay, so let's get back into talking about this awesome app that Samsung released. We'll go back into the Galaxy Store really quick. You can see they use AI best techniques and they invoke by the user to repair and enhance the images stored in the gallery. Um, one can remove unwanted blur reflections and at the same time also sharpen and upscale resolution, improve dynamic range, and brighten photos captured in low light conditions. Now I've been testing this out a little bit. Obviously you do have to grant it storage permissions, of course, to access the photos on your device. I've been testing this out a little bit today and I will say some of these features were already in the gallery app, right? There were some labs features that would remove reflections and things like that, but adding all this magic into a one tap solution and the simplified interface is what makes it great. So let's take a look. If you open the app, it's very, very simple interface. You'll see it's got a little bit of like a little, little glow at the bottom. You see there, it's got a little purple glow at the very bottom of my device. And then this in the center, it just says select a picture. So all you have to do is pick a photo. I'm going to pick a photo here. Here's one of my son. Let me show you guys the blur really quick. This photo is quite blurry. Um, I don't know how, hard, how easy it is to see, but you can kind of see. It's very blurry. He was moving. And uh, so you can try to go to fix blur. And you can see here how well it performs with fixing the blur. And so this is the before. This is the after. It actually does a decent job of removing some blur. It doesn't make it 100% clear but it definitely does remove some of the blur. You guys can certainly see that in the video because as I'm previewing it here on the video, I can see it. And you can go ahead then and apply the edit. Now, some of the features that I really do like is that, of course, all the standard stuff is down here. These one-click solutions, you know, more over here, you can remove reflections just like you would be able to. Uh, you can go to portrait mode, you can do face detection. And then over here in the top corner, you can open new photo, but you're only focusing on one at a time. So you can save this one 
and then move on to a new photo. So you can see then it saves it in your camera roll as another photo. So let's take a look at this one here of him. The other thing you can do is just tap the magic button right here, and it's going to make all the enhancements that the AI thinks are the most optimal for this particular photo. So this adding magic button does a really nice job. It takes a little longer because they're actually processing everything. And I think it really does look good. You guys can see here, the brightness and everything is fixed really well for his skin tone. You can see like it does brighten it up a little bit, but it also applies a nice coloration to the shirt and also kind of fixes my son's skin tone a little bit. It definitely looks a lot better. I think the magic button is really impressive. And uh, you can also, of course, go ahead and then just save it in original or two times resolution. You can upscale the photo as well if you want to right here from within the menu. So that's a really nice feature. Now, of course, HDR, all that, you've got an undo button down here. Up here, you can also share the app, share it right there as well. You can share a photo from directly in here. So you don't have to go back to gallery if you wanna share it to Twitter, you wanna email it, you wanna do Facebook, Instagram. You can also crop within here too. So you don't have to go back to gallery if you wanna crop. So if I just wanted to get my son in here with his shirt, I could go ahead and do that. All of your standard cropping options are in there that you would have in the gallery. So you can kind of do all of this stuff. And of course it does give you the option again to save the photo before you open up another one. And it does save different iterations. So you can see as I was working on it, this is the crop photo that I had. And then these are two of the other ones that I had made edits to before that. Uh, let's take a look at one here in the pool. This is one of my son in the pool. And uh, let's just try really quickly the more option and let's do remove reflections. Let's check the water reflections here because there's some reflections off the water from the lights because this is an indoor pool here in Arizona. And uh, let's take a look at the before and after. So there's the, there's the before and there's the after. You see though that there's like this effect that makes the water like green. So sometimes the reflection still isn't perfect. See, it does remove, here's the reflections on the water, but those reflections aren't really supposed to be all removed. And it kind of turns it into like a green tent in that area, which I don't like. Uh, I would say the reflection part is still one of the most uh, not ideal versions of this, just like in gallery when it was in the lab section, the reflections didn't always work perfectly. But the other things, brighten, HDR, sharpen, and the magic button, they tend to work really well. The magic button in particular is a one press solution, and it seems to do just as good or better than the magic that Google does with Google Photos. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is a very cool new app from Samsung, Galaxy Enhance X. I imagine it's only gonna get better as they update it over time. Of course, I will keep you guys informed with those updates if you wanna to subscribe to the channel to check that out. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification icon for future videos like this. If you guys do want to check out the Ugreen dock, if you're a big DeX user like me and you want a DeX hub to set up your S22 Ultra, your Galaxy Tab, check out the link and the discount code in the description. I appreciate you guys checking out this video and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.